I'm Mark Rosny. I'm Operation Nature Foundation President. Uh, we put on Travel Troops today. Uh, Travel Troops is uh, a charity run and a walk. It uh, features U.S. military personnel running in formation and in cadence. We were in Buffalo, New York on uh, September, or, I'm sorry, May 26th. Uh, on May 27th in Rochester, and we're here today on June 3rd. Uh, the purpose of the event is to uh, line up military personnel and uh, run a 5K while calling out cages. We're very pleased to be at Roosevelt Island, and we look forward to coming back next year. Uh, this morning, on this uh, for a great, a great day and a great event, this is uh, the first ever Trot with Troops here in New York City, and it is Trot with Troops, not Trot for Troops, because I my actually get with U.S. military personnel. I'll tell you a little bit about uh, this event. This uh, was started in uh, 2010 by the Upstate New York-based not-for-profit organization Operation Patriot Foundation. And due to the uh, popularity of the event, Operation Patriot has now expanded into uh, Buffalo and here in New York City. So now uh, this great event is in uh, the three largest cities here in New York City. So that's a great accomplishment. Uh, this was organized not only to pay tribute to our military, but to also raise some much money to support these brave men and women returning from combat. Most of us simply cannot imagine what it is like to experience combat, much less uh, to live with it, relive it on a daily basis. Operation Pre uh, Patriot Foundation needs to help, and we thank you for your support. Now, the money raised today supports the IABA, that's the Iraq and Afghanistan Veterans of America. The IABA is the first and the largest not-for-profit, not partisan organizations for Iraq and Afghanistan veterans. With more than 200,000 member veterans and supporters nationwide, IABA strives to build the new greatest generation. Their programs empower our community online and offline and include smart job fairs, their signature new GI Bill calculator, community of veterans, and a veterans-only social network. Uh, we appreciate your support, and again, it's a great honor for you all to be here, for me to be here with you. Let's begin our ceremony now with our opening prayer. Without God, there is no life. Without God, there is no country. Most righteous and almighty creator, make me an instrument of thy peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, pardon. Where there is doubt, faith. Where there is despair, hope. Where there is darkness, light. Where there is sadness, joy. O Divine Master, grant that I may not so much seek to be consoled as to console, to be understood as to understand, to be loved as to love. For it is in giving that we receive, it is in pardoning that we are pardoned, and it is in dying that we are born to eternal life. Amen. I now welcome now the uh, FDNY ceremonial unit, please. You tell one, two, four. Post colors. Please place your hand over your heart and join me now in the Pledge of Allegiance. And salute. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Ready? Two. It's a great honor now to introduce to you singer and songwriter Amy Rivard, who will sing our national anthem. Amy has performed in 30 countries with shows such as Celtic Woman, Riverdance, X Factor, and Disney. She has sung the anthems for NASCAR, the New York Rangers, and she's honored to be singing for us today. Welcome, Amy. Thank you.
great job. Now my great pleasure to uh, introduce to you U.S. Army 82nd Airborne Veteran and uh, Vice President of the Operation Patriot Foundation, Jose Torres. Good morning, everybody. Uh, thank you, everyone, to join us today. Uh, welcome to Tribal Troops. There's two phases to this. This is not a race. It's a formation run. So what we do is set up a formation for your able runners, fall in front, right behind the military. Those who decide to do the march, there's a different route. The same route, basically, all right, right, right back here, we're going to set up a formation. Um, if you feel a little lightheaded or dizzy, take care of that as well. Pull this side. Please don't pass anybody. Um, again, it's a formation run. Follow the cadence from the left toward the ground. Bark it out loud. We're going to have some fun today. Let's have safe. And uh, again, thank you very much uh, for joining us today. I appreciate it very much. Thank you. Now, I have the great honor to introduce you uh, to uh, U.S. Army Captain Stephen Gary. Now, Captain Gary is joined by a group of young men and women who have made the decision to serve our country. Today, these brave men and women will be publicly sworn to duty to protect the United States of America. Captain Gary.
Oops, sorry. Keep it going. 